Hi guys, this is Cass from West and Cass. Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm doing a review on the Pregnancy Plus app. Um, I used this app pregnant with my first son and I'm using it again for my second son. Um, it's a really, really great app, so here's the review. Okay, so for this app, I love this. Um, this is the Pregnancy Plus app. It's the one that I use the most um, because it is so cool like if you click this right here in the beginning it says um it tells you like good afternoon cassandra tells you how far along you are you click that picture of the baby it tells you i'm not sure you guys can hear that can raise up on my phone i love that like that's like what they hear in the womb you know i don't know why i did that but that's what they hear in the womb so i thought that was really really cool i do like that. that's one of my favorite parts and in the bottom here the little um eye that is like flickery you can click that it gives you like quick little facts about it this is a reproductive organ so it tells you that you can find out what you're having um, sucking movements um, says your baby may be busy sucking its thumb, yawning, kicking in your uterus, and then hair growth. Um, Uriah came out with a whole bunch of hair on his head, so I already know that this baby is going to have a whole bunch of hair as well on his on his head. Hopefully, you know, it should. Um, me and Wesley came out with hair on us, so I'm pretty sure our kids. Anyways, I get like. Anyone that knows me personally knows I get like sidetracked when I like have conversations. i um, probably edit this stuff out anyways. <laughs> and I talk with my hands. All right, anyways, so that's about it for, th for that little the little eye section. I'm gonna give you like three facts. Um, then over, then next to it on the right side has like the actual size, which I think is so weird because I'm like, he cannot be this big. I'm gonna show you guys my bump. Um, in another video, excuse my voice, in another video, um, but he does not feel this big. And then on uh, like a little settings one on the um, left side of the little eye that we just went through has um, like babies that you can choose which one you baby to look at. My kid actually came out looking like <laughs> like this one right here, like the little Asian. You're right, came out looking Asian. Everyone's like, maybe it looks Asian whatever but now he's light-skinned so that's a little I programmed it to look like that so that's enough for this I'm gonna exit out of that so it does give you the due date January 13th that's what I'm expected to do um, it does give you little blogs that you can read um, and then in the bottom here in the actions part they have like your appointments so you can actually um, put your appointments in so I haven't put my next appointment. It's September 13th. I haven't put it in yet. I don't think I did. So I have to do that later. But I, I, I'm really good at remembering my appointments. Um, so yeah, it tells you about all your personal diary, your no tasks selected, just a whole bunch of them. You can actually see more. Then I do like how they do a lot of advertisement on this app. This app does tons of advertisement. Um, so like it for example like for this one right here it says express more milk in less time while pumping so like it's just advertising um that breast pump so that's really really good um and then they give you like how like to like for instance like today i'm actually 20 weeks today yay halfway there um so it tells me halfway there uh congratulations and then this is a really really cool um part of it your baby weekly blog i love reading this like wes and i will sit here we did the same thing with uriah um it wasn't that long ago but i still i try to keep wes in the loop so that he you know to keep him involved i want him to be involved um as much as he could be you know since he's not carrying the baby i want him to be you know involved in it so anyway so it tells you about your baby your body health and tips and then partners info cool app if you really want your husband or spouse to be involved they give you an actual paragraph that he can read or she can read you know whichever you prefer so anyways and then if you have twins or multiples so pretty pretty cool i do like that and you can also add photo of your bump which i haven't done this week because like i said i'm 20 weeks a day and at the top over here you see it says week 20 and i can keep going on and all that stuff so that's pretty cool so i'm gonna go back to today 
um, activity tips and then it tells you yesterday so it'll give you like so if you're on the app and you like need you know like what happened yesterday I didn't go my up here yesterday it keeps all that for you so I do love all that and it keeps on going and then um, another favorite part that I do like is um your belly at five months so you click that like I said my baby does not feel this big but hey that's what they're saying that the baby is like that big um, another thing side note he I, my baby is big because um when the um anatomy scan that we just had for the 18 weeks he is measuring um a couple days i think she said like about like five days i don't know something like that ahead of the due date so the baby was on the heavier side so that's just you know little side note go back to today i'm gonna scroll down did you know the placenta has reached its maximum thickness and is busy supplying your baby all the nutrients and oxygen and disposing of the waste. That's cool. And it gives you the option to share anything you want to share. So if you want to let your family, friends know, text messages, Snapchat, you know how us young people do. We got to let everybody know everything. Um, so, yep. Oh, and this is enough. I have a lot of favorites on this app. I'm telling you guys, a lot of favorites. Oh, it does talk about um, symptoms. You know, I am going to make a... A 20 week update on my symptoms and what I'm going through. I'm gonna show you guys my belly um, so you guys can see how big I am because everyone swore I was having a little girl. That's how big my stomach, you know. But a few people were saying, No, you've been a boy, you've been a boy. I thought I was having a girl because everybody was getting me excited because I already have a boy, so I was excited for the girl. But hey, it's okay. I'm so excited with my little, my little man, another little man. But, anyways, like I was saying, scan week 19. I love this because it gives you like an actual baby in the womb in a 3d scan and you can also click right here on the left 2d scan that is awesome that is awesome I'm gonna show you guys this baby's um, my baby in my stomach <laughs> um, 2d scan I didn't get a 3d scan with Uriah I'm probably not gonna do a 3d scan with this baby he doesn't have a name yet so that's why it's just this baby but um I haven't done I haven't done um, a 3D scan with your eyes. So I'm probably not gonna do one with this one. I wanted to, but we just decided to keep his looks a surprise when he was born, which we were happy with that. So I'm gonna back out, go back to today, and like I said, the days keep going back. So that's pretty much it. Okay. So on this, then if you look all the way in the bottom, I'm gonna show you guys. It says today, baby, me, more. I'm gonna go to baby. And it gives you your daily, your weekly images, size, timeline, baby names. So, which is so cool because you can click that and you can mess with that. Then me, that talks about my stuff, um, guides, my weights, my belly, birth plan, appointments, and to do, like a checklist. And then for more, it gives you a hospital bag, like what you should like probably pack in your hospital bag if you don't know. Um, with Uriah, I constantly... Like, I watch YouTube videos because I did not know what to bring. Like, I, you know, and you don't want to, like, do too much. I'm actually, when I get closer to that time frame, I'm going to do a hospital bag. Like, let you guys see what what's in my hospital bag. Um, for me and for baby, and probably was. Uriah, I'm hoping that somebody in the family can, like, watch him for us. Because I'm not trying to bring him in the hospital. And there's going to be too much going on for him, I think. So, it does give you a few things like that. Hospital bag, shop. Kit counter, contractions, feedback, and facts. So that's pretty much it with this app. Like I said, this app is, I love it. And then you, you put your little picture, you can personalize it. So this is me. Oh, I don't know what that is. Okay, so this is me. You know, so it talks about like your menu, or your settings, all that stuff down there. Pregnancy, I'm having a boy, everyone knows. Um, yeah, so. It's pretty cool I actually like it so I'm gonna close that out yeah so that's pretty much it guys um, thank you guys so much for watching please subscribe to our channel if you haven't already um, whatever you want me or my husband to do we will do um, you know like video wise content we are really into that right now because we're an upcoming youtubers and we don't know like much you know so we 
anything like we would just love suggestions on anything um but thanks like i said i'm Cass. Uh, my husband is wes and then we have a little boy named uriah and a second baby on the way hope you guys enjoy this video and it helped you guys out with choosing a pregnancy app so i'm gonna let you guys go bye